happy Monday, everybody. I hope everybody had a good New Year weekend, and I hope everybody enjoyed their New Year. And I hope everybody is looking forward to 2023. And I hope everybody bring in uh, bring in this year uh, lovely. I want to say that um, everything is good with me. Everything is good with me. Uh, I kind of been stressed out a, a, a lot of things. I kind of been stressed out. Uh, this stress, you understand what I'm saying? And I want to also say that to my supporters, that I apologize for falling asleep yesterday on my computer. Um, I stay up late at night trying to get a lot of content for y'all. And I wake up early in the morning because, of course, y'all know that I'm paralyzed and I got to wake up to for my um, caregiver. So I try to instead of me doing my my content during the day, I try to I wait I I just sit up and watch TV all day instead of doing my content while I'm sitting up in here watching TV. I wait and do my content later on. I end up getting tired and I go to sleep. I take a pain pill and I go to sleep, and then I wake up. Like maybe about a little bit before eleven o'clock, and rush and try to do a video. And by that time, my body's tired. So, but for that, I want to say how oh, I'm sorry. But I want to move on. I want to react to the legendary newswoman, Barbara Walters, has passed away. At the age of 93. You know, she had been around for a long time. I didn't even know she had been around that long. She had been a journalist. And she had passed away, y'all. And I had seen it last night on YouTube. I'm sorry, y'all. I had seen it last night on YouTube. And I was like, Oh my God, this woman, this woman here has, you know, passed away, you know, at the age of 93. She she was the one that started that show, The View. And when I seen that she had passed away, I was just like, I was, uh, it was sad, you know, she, she had, she had cute. She had quit the view in twenty. I think it was twenty fourteen because she said she was having some type of surgery. I don't want to air her business out. Like that. You know, and I I do remember that Oprah was bringing everybody on to her show, uh, to show and give a tribute tribute to Barbara Walters. I was like, oh my God, this woman has really, this woman has really passed away. It, it, it was sad. I just couldn't believe it. I couldn't believe that this woman had Um, she had been around for so long. You know what I'm saying? She the one that gave Whoopi Goldberg her shot on The View. Uh, and because y'all remember that lady Megan. I don't mean to be disrespectful. That white lady named Megan. 
and she was always arguing with uh Whoopi. That was because I think she was really jealous of Whoopi. That's what I think. But I can be wrong. But I just want to say that to I don't know what to say, y'all, because it's just so sad, you know. There's something that you don't never think about that a person like her has passed away, you know. You never really heard anything about her in the headlines. You never did, you know. She had it, it they had it on YouTube where they were showing that she she had did some good journalism. She had did um she had did the interview with Monica Quinn I, I can't pronounce her name, but anyway, Monica who slept with Bill Clinton. That she sit there and said she told Bill. She asked uh Monica, Well, did you ever tell Bill Clinton that you love him? And she said, Yeah. And I was like, girl, how can you sleep with another woman's husband. But she did. And this is the thing. I don't really think Monica slept with Bill. She did the, you know, I ain't gonna say it, but y'all know what I'm talking about. And what else? She did like Barbara Walters did a lot of interviews over the years with people. She did an interview with Whitney Houston. She did an interview with Michael Jackson. She did an interview with, uh, what's that guy over there? I think she did an interview with the Pope. She did an interview for Donald Trump. She did an interview with Oh, she did an interview about the royal palace where Princess Diana died. She did that interview. She did an interview about um, William and Kate marriage. Oh, yeah, she did. She did it. Yeah, I am actually sitting here watching as I record Sher Sherry show and this guy on here I don't know what he got on the on his head, but his body is look like his right child. Let me get back to y'all. <laughs> so anyway, oh yeah, I'm sorry, that was my fault. That was my fault. I don't want to know. So she done, she done, she done a lot. I mean, and Oprah was sitting there saying if it wasn't for her, she wouldn't be on TV. Barbara Walters, I'm not gonna say made Oprah what she was today. I didn't look, y'all, I didn't even know um Tamara. I think I saw her name Tamara. I didn't even know Tamara. Um, I didn't even know Tamara knew Barbara Walters. I didn't even know Tamara worked with Barbara Walters. Tam that's her name, Tamara Hall. The girl I told y'all that I didn't too much care for. She ain't no girl, but she's a woman. But yeah, I didn't even know that she she really worked with Barbara Walters. Basically, I, I don't really, really think I really cared. You understand what I'm saying? Because I feel like she really, Tamara Hall to me, really had some issues. That's what I feel like. That's what I feel like. But. 
it was a lot of uh Robin and they I want to I want to make sure I say her name right. Robin Roberts from I think it's the little morning show. You know, she was on her. You know, it was a lot of them on her. You know, uh a lot of people Oprah had on there that was giving tribute that you know you would never doubt that Oprah had on there. And I know as you know, I know it's gonna be some mess where people were gonna be sitting there saying that Oprah um Oprah um Let me see. Oprah care more about the white people. Because, you know, that's what everybody used to always say. Oprah care more about the white people. And it wasn't that Oprah cared more about the white people. I think you go with the people that give you a chance. And I think it's nothing wrong with that. I think it's nothing wrong with that. You go with the people that give you a chance. Because being black and being in society, some people just don't want to give you a chance in life to strive to do better, to strive to make it. You understand what I'm saying? You know, and Oprah is from the South. And Oprah, you can tell she kind of had like a hard life. That's why when Monique was sitting there saying that Monique was blaming Oprah because her mama came, uh, uh, Monique mama came on it on this show, and Monique brother came on this show, and um, uh, Monique said Oprah knew the situation, but I wanted to say, why are you getting mad at her? I didn't understand it. You know what I'm saying, y'all? I didn't understand it. Why are you getting mad at her? You know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, if you look at it and you look at the situation, um, that's your situation. They call Oprah to discuss it. You know what I'm saying? And Monique was blaming Oprah because the relationship of her and her mama got now. And I think that as a journalism, I think that Oprah had learned a lot from, uh, hold on y'all. Okay, y'all, I'm back. So therefore I, I was just like, um, I think I think a lot of the women that knew Barbara Walters, I think they learned I think they learned a lot from her. You understand what I'm saying? They learned how to be professional. I think they learned how to be journalism. You understand what I'm saying? Because I feel like Barbara Walters was she was smart. I think she was an entrepreneur for real. You know, she just didn't want to interview people and she just didn't interview the biggest people because if y'all remember Hugh the guy from Ruby Ring she had him on the view she Barbara Walters had her own show but she quit the view so I don't know if she gave the view to um Whoopi Goldberg I don't know what happened but I do know that uh, she gave everybody a chance on the view. It was Sherry Shepard, Whoopi Goldberg. She gave Raven Simone. Uh, who else? And there was some white women on there, of course. Oh, and Joe. And, and what is it, George? What, what was that comedian name? I don't like her though. She always trying to make fun, and you know, I don't like her. But uh, oh, and the one that um. Uh, and she's a cook, but her dad is a doctor, Dr. Oz's daughter. Yeah. All of them is on her show. And I think that's good. I really do. I think that's good. 
But yeah, I'm not gonna get. I'm not gonna stay on here too long. I just wanted to get on here and say rest in peace to Barbara Walters and uh, my heart goes out to her family. That's all I wanted to say. I love y'all. Bye.